so we had a little uh, challenge with American Airlines because it is that we booked our airline tickets through them directly. We didn't use like Travelocity or any other thing because we thought that the best way would go was to book directly through the airlines. And we had even purchased the insurance. So unfortunately, as soon as they canceled the cruises, you know, the first thing we're doing is trying to get refunds on you know, rental cars, hotels, and stuff like that. And all of that went pretty smoothly, except for the airline. Uh, they decided that they were just gonna keep all of our money. And I, you know, I, I could even see like a, a penalty or, you know, some kind of fine or something like that for, for canceling the, the airline tickets, but I just don't understand how it is they think that they're gonna keep all of the airline money when, when we're not even gonna go. Uh, to be fair, they did say that you know, we had uh, that credit to use, but we, you know, we only had a year from the time that we booked. Well, we booked back in January uh, for those flight tickets, so you know that gives us until January, and who knows how long this crazy thing's going to last. And we really didn't have any interest to, to hang out in Miami anyway, given that Florida is such a hot spot. No offense, Floridians, um, but we just wanted to get a refund, you know, on our on our airline tickets, and we fought tooth and nail. My wife fought, I should say. I give her all the credit. Uh, she's been on the phone with these people fighting tooth and nail and even to the point where it was like when they weren't going to give us the money she filed a complaint with the Better Business Bureau of Texas or in Texas or whatever and um, they pretty much left it tough you know we got your money you know what are you going to do about it um, and so the last thing that we could think of or th to do was go to the bank this is something I think people normally do with credit cards and dispute those charges and tell them, you know, no services were rendered and she had to set that up with the bank and I think that that was like at 4 o'clock today. It's it's 6.15 now in the evening and that money is now back on our card. So if anybody else is having this problem, that's the way you do it because apparently the airline is not going to give you back your money. I don't know how it works out if you use like a Travelocity or or other provider like that, you know, if, if it's easier to get your money back, but at least our experience with American Airlines was you're not getting your money back, at least from them, so um, way to go, wifey, for showing them how the bear ate the buckwheat.